Okay, again, what we're looking at here is we're just having two passers. Everybody's getting charted. So the passers are getting charted. The servers are getting charted. And uh, what we're looking at is, you know, we have a couple people together. We may switch them around. What we're really looking to see, we have our setters at the net, either doing some setting or just uh, targeting the ball. And again, it's we're doing this for, uh, this is a time frame thing. And at the end of this, we'll have some data that we can look at that, uh, that we'll use and seeing who's passing well and who plays well together. Get there and have your hips facing me and not at the last minute. It's not a cameo. And I don't want to see you doing that. And depending on how many courts you have and how many people you really have in your, in your passing system that you'd want to look at, that's because you're moving better. I mean, you were facing me, but the set wasn't good. <laughs> now that's the one you have to get to in forearm pass. Push it out a little bit. Nice serve. And you know, if you have a jump server, then you just have them move and peg past half that court. You don't have two people passing a good jump server, but you let her pick one half of the court and that's where she goes at. That's a good serve. That's a good serve there. Hey, I thought it was a good serve. I don't care where your hands are when you're serving. Get there, you big knucklehead, we're setting, right? You're the center? I brought you in as the center? I got a whole bunch of forearm passers out here. And don't break the rules. Hey, two seniors shouldn't be getting aced here. 